how to get AI voice models for the AI voice changer. So if you don't have the hardware to train or you simply just don't want to train an RVC voice model, there is a Discord group that you can go to to download some voice models. I personally am not distributing my voice models as it's trained on data that is not mine and I don't want to be responsible for anything that gets misused with the voice models that I've trained. And of course, I think there is just a little bit of common sense when using tools like this to not say anything that's stupid or not do things that are stupid. So I'm no moral arbiter. I'm not going to tell you how you should think, but I advocate just use these voices responsibly. And that's just my small little two cents right there. Well, there is this AI Hub Discord. So this AI Hub Discord has 150,000 members. And to become one of those, we're just going to go into this Discord link right here. And it's going to bring us over into a page where it's going to ask if you want to join the server. I have already joined the server, so I would just continue over on into Discord and, you know, you need a Discord account for this to work. And it has, um, you know, a bunch of different chats that you can go and look through if you want to train models, um, curate data sets. And um, the big one is this voice models one. So inside of here, you can go and scroll down and scroll through and actually download some voice models. So let's scroll down um, and I'm going to show you an example of how you can use it. So um, here's this Sakura Miko one right here. Um, you're going to see it pop up on the left, on the right side, and there's going to be a link to where you can download it. If it is not a hugging face link, do not go to it. Um, it, ha it should be a hugging face link as hugging face is where these uh, models are hosted. And as well, we don't know where these links are. You, we don't know who the users are or the creators. So please download at your own risk. Um, so when you click on it, this window is going to pop up. So you can go to continue to download and it's going to bring you to Google where um, it'll say download the zip folder. So in this case, we're just going to go ahead and save it. And then once it's saved, we're going to go ahead, right click and extract all. So we're going to extract it and then navigate into it. And so inside of here, you should have a .pth file and then you should have an index file. So, so once you have those, you're going to go ahead and boot up the voice changer. And once the voice changer pops up, uh, make sure you click RVC, go ahead, do start and then go to edit. And we're going to go ahead and find the voice model. So we're going to click the Miko PTH, go ahead, do open. And then if you want, you can add an index to it. The index is just going to be this file here You can click open and then we'll click this upload button. So it's going to upload. Now this is version one RVC. So there are version two RVC voice models as well out there that you can find. And version two is what I've used to train all of my models. So once we click on it, we're going to change the tune up to 12 and then we're going to do all the settings as we did in the previous video. And then we can just go ahead and start and then we can go ahead and hear how the voice model sounds. So here we are and um, this is how the voice model sounds. So if um, we increase the jump, it might get a little bit clearer. But um, but yeah, this is RVC1 and overall not too bad. All right, so that's going to be it for this video today. Just something quick, short, and um, this is like my most asked question. So hopefully that answers your guys' questions. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a future video.